Hello, this is Leopold from Vapernotes. Uh, I will show you Le Mirage, uh, which is our uh, new atomizer. Uh, it's coming in an uh, aluminum box. And inside, there is a pink bubbles paper with the atomizer. And then at the inside, the spare kit with two pink plugs and o rings and uh, one uh, screw M3. So you can use this screw only for uh, dual coil with Clapton coil. Inside the pink bubble, there is the, the zip lock with the atomizer inside. And also at the inside, there is the gray o-ring for sealing. So you can place directly this o-ring into the spare kit. Okay, here we go. There is the um, engraved Vaponaut Paris, fabriqué en France, le Mirage, and the serial number. At the inside, there is the deck with two holes from coils. You can do a single coil and uh, use the pink plug. When you unscrew the deck from the tank, so there is the gray o-ring for sealing. When you screw it back, please screw hard to make it seal. And when it's blocked, we are good. This is the uh, central positive post, which is uh, perpendicular to the axe of both uh, coil holes. You can uh, screw it harder as you can to keep it in position. On the top there is a screw with no head. And then you can easily go with two, two wires in the same time for dual coils. We'll screw the atomizer on the mod, the jumbo jet, to make it easier the building. The best is to turn your coil in this way. We will now make six wraps for dual coils with uh, 26 gauge Cantal A1. We will now place both coils. The first one in this way. The best is to uh, take the wire from here and then place it like this and then screw. We will now do exactly the same on the opposite.
the best is only to use the coil jig 2.5 millimeter and you can now adjust the, the coil. You cut what you don't need and then you push on the wire to um, to make space for the um, for the top cap. Let's push on the button. We will now talk about the top cap. So there is the metal part with three holes. One, you use only one for single coil, or you can use both if, if you like it. And then you can adjust to make it open to close. And exactly the same for dual coils. Now both are open and when you turn you can go open to close from zero to three millimeter. Here is the most important piece, the chamber in peak, which is the um, most the, the best uh, material for uh, it in terms of plastic, so it's the most resistant one. And then there is the air hole. And it's coming from left to right, turning all around the center post, and it's touching first coil and at the end the second. And there is the same on the opposite, uh, 180 degrees. And then, so it's coming like that inside the chamber and it's turning all around going to the drip tip so it's making the vortex effect as you can see so there is a two like a milled on the top cap and this both milled helps you to place the peak top cap on the atomizer. So you have to be in line. Like this. It's definitely in line with the um, weak hole. So you place the peak inside the metallic top cup piece.
we will now place the cotton. And we will now cut what we don't need. And we will fill the tank with uh, night flight. It's really easy to fill the tank exactly like um, Le Magister or Le Zephyr. Now we will close the top cap in the line, as you can see. The milled guide will help you to push the top cap. And then if you turn the top cap clockwise, so it will block. And then you are now in the good position if you want to adjust the airflow. So the best is to keep the peak piece in position and then only turn the metal part of the top cap open to close. Or you can adjust it like this and then put the top cap back. Let's see how it vape. I will show you now um, a build with a Clapton coil single coil and I'm also using the plug on the opposite. Make sure when you put the top cap back to be in line always. Let's see how it vape. Thank you for watching us. Have a good vape with Le Mirage.